Velarization is a secondary articulation of consonants by which the back of the tongue is raised toward the velum during the articulation of the consonant. In the International Phonetic Alphabet, velarization is transcribed by one of four diacritics. A tilde or swung dash through the letter U plus 0334, combining tilde overlay HTML, covers velarization, uvelarization and pharyngealization, as in, the velarized equivalent of L. A superscript Latin gamma U plus O2 E0 modifier letter small gamma HTML after the letter standing for the velarized consonant, as in T a velarized T. To distinguish velarization from a velar fricative release, may be used instead of a superscript W U plus O2 B7 modifier letter small W indicates either simultaneous velarization and labialization, as in S or P, or labialization of a velar consonant, as in K. Although electropalidographic studies have shown that there is a continuum of possible degrees of velarization, the IPA does not specify any way to indicate degrees of velarization, as the difference has not been found to be contrastive in any language. However, the IPA convention of doubling diacritics to indicate a greater degree can be used. Topic: Examples. Topic: English. A common example of a velarized consonant is the velarized alveolar lateral approximant or Dark L. In some accents of English, such as received pronunciation, the phoneme L has dark and light allophones. The dark velarized allophone appears in syllable coda position, e.g., in full, while the light non velarized allophone appears in syllable onset position, e.g., in lawn. Other accents of English, such as Scottish English, Australian English, and General American English, have dark L. In all positions. Topic: <inaudible> Velarized L. Albanian phonemically contrasts light L and dark L L. Catalan dialect and allophonic variants. Portuguese dialect and allophonic variants. Turkish. Kurdish for many languages, velarization is generally associated with more dental articulations of coronal consonants so that dark L tends to be dental or dentoalveolar, and clear L tends to be retracted to an alveolar position. Other velarized consonants Danish realizes, D, in some environments as a velarized Irish has velarized consonants that systematically contrast with palatalized consonants. Russian has velarized consonants as allophones before Scottish Gaelic has a three-way contrast in nasals and laterals between n tilde n tilde and l tilde l tilde. Kurdish has three velarized consonants s and z which contrast with plain ones the palatalized velarized contrast is known by other names especially in language pedagogy in irish language teaching the terms slender for palatalized and broad for velarized are often used the terms light or clear for non velarized or palatalized and dark for velarized are also widespread the terms soft l and hard l are not equivalent to light l and dark l the former pair refers to palatalized, soft, or iotated, and plain, hard, Slavic consonants. <laughs> 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 